eyeglass lenses start out as large plastic discs. The first step is to place a protective film over the convex side, so it won't get damaged while the lab works on the concave side. With a scanner, they retrieve the customer's prescription from the central computer, then program those measurements into the tray holding the discs. Next, they heat up a mixture of seven metals to 50 degrees Celsius. Any hotter would melt the disc on contact. Out of that molten metal, they mold an attachment. This allows the disc to be mounted on a machine for tooling. At this point, robots take over. When the tray with the discs arrives, the milling machine reads the prescription information, then reshapes the plastic accordingly. First, it thins the disc and shaves it down to a smaller diameter. Then, it creates the required curvature. The disc is now a lens. But you can still see the concentric circles left by the tooling, and the surface of the lens is rough. So, they polish it using abrasive paper under water heated precisely to 19 degrees Celsius. The water temperature must be constant or else the lens will become deformed. Now that the lens is perfectly shaped, they remove the metal attachments. Then peel off the protective film on the other side. Using a machine called a lensometer, they make sure the prescription is accurate. Next, the lenses go through an automated 15-stage chemical cleaning, then are coated with varnish to make them scratch resistant. They go into an oven for three hours until the varnish cures. Next comes the anti-reflection treatment. This will increase the lens's transparency, allowing in more light. The lenses go into a chamber. They add different powdered chemicals, such as silicium oxide, titanium oxide, and zirconium oxide. They close the door, then pump all the air out of the chamber. Using a high-powered electron beam, they heat the chemicals to the boiling point. The powders transform from solid to gas, coating the lenses in the process. It's finally time to fit the lenses to the frame. They position a suction cup on the lenses to hold them in place during the fitting. An automated machine traces the shape of the frame, then cuts the lenses to that shape. With regular frames, the lenses simply pop in. To attach ultralight metal frames, they drill holes right through the lenses. from plastic disc to the latest in eyewear in just three days.